that you control me Guilty self-affliction Prey on me when I'm lonely And I'm your willing victim My friends already told me But I don't wanna listen Hey, remember him, guys? From our first GPS video? Ain't no. Look at him, you're super. I'm, I'm, I'm like, you know, because I'm the same dude with the first You're a supervisor now. I'm a supervisor. My supervisor. Yeah, you bought boss now. Hey, look. He used to teach me how to load, now I teach him how to do other stuff. Boy, I knew how to do this before you. <laughs> hey, are you striking? Like what? Are you striking? Why are you recording me? Are you going on strike? Yes or no? Why are you trying to? Why are you trying to incriminate me? It's for my OnlyFans. Are you striking? I'm being a fan. It's for my OnlyFans. Come on, just say yes or no. You're only fan. Are you being a scab? You being a scab? Yeah, I'm gonna talk to the supervisor and get promoted. So what are you doing? Huh? So what are you doing? Are you striking? Talk to the full time and get promoted. You're gonna get promoted. Oh, you're a scab. You the worst of the worst. I'm taking an opportunity to earn a actual. <laughs> Go on strike with me. Go on strike with me. You see that? You see that teamster, uh, uh, struggling UPS union worker. He's a fake. Damn, look. But I have me slaving in the joint. Look. Right out the slide. They sending my ass down here to load. Like, bro. They be using the fuck out of me. Bro, this shit pissing me off, bro. I did a half a truck on another destination. And now they put me here. Like, bro, this shit pissing me off. Look at this shit. They got me slaving out here, guys. UPS underpaid slaves. Oh my God. <sighs> All right, guys, so I'm back in my car. We finished so late. Yo. Yo, that had me so pissed. I ain't gonna hold you. So like I was upstairs sorting and you know, getting, you, you saw like getting torched. You know, we were getting torched by moving fast and everything, working hard. Bro, they sent they sent me downstairs to the fucked up trucks that we were sending this shit to. Had me load most of the trucks, just me. Like, yo, I was just fed up, bro. I was mad. I'm like, yo, like, 
I'm over there sweating, hot as shit, working hard. Instantly, I go downstairs and lower. And I was planning on doing a double too. And I literally just got into my car in the shift. I was planning on doing, they, they've already started like 30 minutes ago now. We're going on strike. That amount of work we just did, we feel like we need more pay. And I'm, this video, I know this video is a little different than what I usually make. It seems like there's a high chance of us going on strike. So, and, and if we do go on strike, this will be like one of the biggest strikes in America's history. So I work at UPS and I just wanted to talk about it for a little bit. For one thing, the union is trying to push, not trying to force like excessive overtime, more days off. And for like a lot of workers, that's kind of true. I know a couple of drivers and like they, they do crazy hours and a lot of them like drivers and like full time that do crazy hours their marriage falls apart family falls apart now that i'm thinking about it like ups yes ups is pretty hard on the body that's what a lot of people i see are saying and like i'm still young i go to the gym right after like i do doubles triples and i still hit the gym right after it does break down the body I see so many old heads in the warehouse. Bro, I, I kid you not. The way they walk, they limping. Like, a lot of them full-timers, full they're limping. They could barely walk. No, a lot of people are complaining about hours. Especially the part-timers that, uh, that it's not enough. It's not enough to live off three hours, four hours. At least in my hub, that's never been an issue. Um... I'm always doing triples, doubles, like every single day. So hours never been an issue for me. I don't know about other hub. It seems like for them, it is a big issue. July 5th, UPS said they were gonna bring like their best offer in the contract. And it was just a, basically just a spin the face to us. They want to decrease pay, especially like with the drivers, like the new, the new drivers coming in, they want them you guys to make less than other drivers are doing for for like the same work and everything for less pay also little ass pay for like over the next four or five years of the contract they finally just now agreed on putting fan i mean acs on the truck it, it took them this long like we're in 2023 and if and they finally agreed on putting ac in them in them um delivery truck like UPS could be just could be so backwards sometimes. There's a lot of issue with the 22.4. It's not looking so good, but we still got weeks. Uh, we still got weeks before um, before the deadline is over, before the the current contract is over. And if we go on strike, that would be insane. That would mess up UPS big time. Even one day of going on strike, we'll have UPS behind. Imagine one week. Most of the workers I asked said they are going on strike. I, I would too, if it comes down to it. Like man, we deserve more. I started working during COVID, like early COVID, 2020, early. There were no extra pay for us for putting our life on the line. And during COVID, UPS was booming. It was like peak season, you know, it was peak season not during peak season and another issue i got too so as a part-time employee you know what really suck I'm so like i said i've been here for years three years now a guy that started yesterday is making the exact same pay as i am right now being here for years working hard for years we're making the same pay a, a dude that's been here for four five years it's making the same pay as a guy from yesterday like that that's insane bro i got years ahead of him i know the union is also trying to open up more uh full-time position and if that's the case i hope it's like i hope it's true it comes into effect because man during the years i've been there i listed myself so many times throughout the years and still haven't been able to get a position. 
I know they say seniority comes in play, but uh, favoritism also come in play for sure. <laughs> I wrote my name for like uh, package delivery driver, uh, preload, just full time, full time um, twilight night shift. Haven't gotten, haven't gotten any of them. I know guys that's been here for like five, six years. Still part-timers waiting for that full-time position. Why can't you do full-time position? How many people willing to do both shift instead of hiring part-timers? Yeah, and I do get the part-timers on why they feel underpaid. I do agree because you do three or four hours of hard labor work. Uh, you know, it's hot, sweaty, and you look at your paycheck, then you wonder to yourself like, is working here worth it a lot of them they're too tired doing the next shift right after their shift to get more hours to fi to finally see a decent paycheck we'll see man time will tell weeks till this contract is over will we strike or will we get a fair contract so guys please subscribe <laughs> please subscribe i need that youtube money i need that youtube money and let me know if you guys will be striking too.